hello and welcome dear spiritual friends thank you for being with me my name is Cindy St. Martin and I'm a certified angel therapist holistic healer and Reiki master for the mind body spirit and soul and you're watching my weekly angel card reading for the week of January 29th 2017 so thank you all for being with me I'm so glad you're here I love your support and your comments and your likes uh, it really blesses me more than you could ever know. So we had just had a new moon on Friday, and that's the time where we put our intentions out there, write them down, things that we want and hope to manifest uh, by the time, or begin to manifest by the time of the next full moon. So I hope you took advantage of that, and um, if you forgot, <laughs> that's okay. Uh, you can catch the next new moon. Uh, but if you're catching this today here on Saturday as I'm posting it, the energies are still strong from the new moon, so go ahead and do it, uh, you know, today. So, uh, and we're going to begin a new month this week, which is exciting. The month of February, it's the month of love and uh, St. Valentine's Day. So I hope you're making some plans to share some of that love or give some of that love or do something special. So I had already called upon God, the Ascendant Masters, the angels and archangels to be with me. And because of law of attraction and power of intention, I cannot select the wrong card. I will select one card from three different decks and then a prayer card from Archangel Michael. So I'm going ahead, I'm shuffling uh, the angel tarot cards and we'll see what our first card for the week is. Okay, so I'm cut the deck. And the card is the page of air. And it reads, it says, a challenge challenging information delays or changes to plans. Truth delivered without tact. Now some people might think that's a bad card, of course. I look at it as a really good uh, card. Challenging information, delays or changes to plans. Is God saying, this is not right for you? <laughs> so when we get challenging information that challenges us or makes us crazy, whatever, it means there's something wrong here. <laughs> so take that red flag and, and make the changes that you need. If there's delays or changes to plans, it means maybe you're moving too fast. So God's holding you back for the right divine moment okay and of course changes to plans are a blessing because if you stayed with that plan it wasn't going to be the right thing for you so whenever something holds us back anything that's challenging uh delays or changes always say thank you god <laughs> you know for shielding and uh, protecting you even archangel michael from shielding and if you shield and protect all the time know that they're working in your favor okay now truth delivered without tact maybe you're frustrated because of the changes and what's going on and and so you speak without thinking okay or maybe it's somebody else that's going through challenging things and being delayed and they speak to you without thinking aha so now it's either you or somebody else but these are the energies that are around us pay in mind that these are blessings take a deep breath and make sure be cautious and aware of what you say because that's the energies that you're putting out to the universe and we want to put love energies out there not more ego or negative energies out there so be very very careful of what you speak now if somebody else speaks to you keep in mind they're frustrated <laughs> you know if people say things when they're frustrated and and it's ego and they may not have the awareness that you have okay so you want to make sure that you have this awareness and just give them a hug don't let them bother. Don't, don't let their negative form of ego pull you in. Okay? Just let them be and send them love for that. So, okay. So, that's, you know, it's a pretty good card. <laughs> Especially maybe when we're starting a new month. There might be some challenging things that we want to do or, or make. But it's all okay. All right? <laughs> so, now I'm going ahead and shuffle the Whisper of Love cards. And we'll see... Uh, what message our love angels have for us.
Okay, so we've kept it there. Love angels tell us what else? Spend some quality time together. And the card reads, it says, it's imperative that we spend quality time with those we are in a significant relationship with, listening and talking to each other. Okay, so... <laughs> Oops, or significant other or anything uh, to that effect. But for those who, are, who aren't in, in a, a significant relationship, we do have significant people in our lives. You know, whether they're our children or our parents or our siblings or friends or co-workers, you know. So sometimes, sometimes they really need to have that time with you. Maybe they really need to make that connection with you. Maybe they want to tap into your wisdom. You know, or maybe it's you that needs to connect with somebody like that. Maybe you need that for healing, you know. So spend some quality time together. Make the time to spend with a loved one or someone who's significant in your life. And it's going to enhance your relationship, you know, listening and talking to each other. Bonding with each other is really, really, really super important for that. Okay, so that's a good card, huh? So now uh, I'm going to shuffle the Law of Attraction cards. And we'll see what intention our angels want us to say for this week. And these cards help bring um, abundance and prosperity. Okay. doubt of course doubt is, is ego no doubt and the affirmation that the angels want us to practice is I will eventually achieve success because I don't allow myself to doubt now doubt have any form of doubt is definitely ego and we all know ego ego stands for edging God out it's everything that's negative if we put doubt out there, we're delaying our our manifestation. We're de delaying our abundance. We're delaying our success. Don't doubt. Don't have worry. Don't fear. Don't doubt. Don't lack confidence. Stay confident and be excited. Now, this might be true, <laughs> you know, with the delays or changes to plans. <laughs> you say to yourself, I will eventually achieve this success because I don't allow myself to doubt. I stay positive and I trust the process. And I know that these delays, changes, red flags are steering me in the right direction. And I need to spend some time alone and talk to people. Help me figure things out or help somebody else to figure things out. that are going through this, especially if they talk <laughs> in not a nice way. <laughs> okay, so... These cards all come together. Great, great uh, information for this week. Hopefully, you, you're enlightened and inspired by it. So now I'm going to shuffle. Go ahead and shuffle um, the Archangel Michael prayer cards. We'll see what message and prayer he has for us. Okay, so I'm cut the deck. Archangel Michael tells us, use your imagination and you'll see the answer. And the prayer reads, it says, Dear God, thank you for granting me the wisdom and creativity to see your miracles in new and unexpected ways. I gratefully and graciously accept and appreciate your help with this situation. This goes back to the page of air card, you know, challenging information, giving gratitude, say thank you for not 
putting me completely through this, helping me see, showing gratitude, you know, use your imagination. You're going to see the answer. You're going to see that anything that you think is negative is actually a blessing because it's stopping you or making you change the direction or how you think to make things better. So great, great, great card. So thank you all again for spending this time with me. And of course, I invite you to visit my website at cindyshealing.com. There maybe you would like to have a session with me. It's very affordable for an hour session. Pick the price that's in your budget and we'll get together and we'll tell you how to make your life better. And it also includes an angel card reading. If you just want an angel card reading, we can do that too. That's only 30 minutes. The information is on on my website and of course if you're interested in having some energy healing reiki healing we can do distance or in person whatever you need if you're going through something and it's it, the energy healing is good for everything everything and also good for pets as, as well and of course while you're on my website uh, maybe uh, you'd like to connect with me through social media and all my sites are there the links are there and I will look forward to connecting with you with that as well so thank you for being with me again i'm very grateful have a wonderful wonderful first week into february may be a wonderful blessed month and know that you're powerful when you're knowing when you have god the ascendant masters the angels and archangels behind you you're powerful there's no stopping you and by the way if if you connect with me through facebook i do stream live several nights a week doing a reading and and get some inspiration enlightenment and empowerment uh, so if you want to tune in range anywhere from like 7 30 to 8 30 so if you're online pop in and, and see me okay but let your love and peace fall down upon the earth god knows we need these energies so bad and know that god blesses and loves you and so do i send you love and kisses and of course, I wish you all namaste. Thank you for spending this time with me. And have a good week. And I'll see you next week. Bye-bye. Okay, <laughs>